Hello and welcome to Mr Ridley's Design and Technology. In this clip we're going to look at a GCSE style question on based around the communication of ideas and this is a, a question on design collaboration. So I've said, it, I've said it as an eight mark question but the point is this is a longer question so they range maybe even up to ten marks but approaching these is sometimes more daunting so we'll just take a look at this. So if we start off, um, it's always good to start with a, a, an overarching statement. So I could say something like designers working together is called collaboration. Now, I think people often find it difficult to see how to start one of these questions. So just this overarching statement, just to say, look, I know what I'm talking about. Um, there are many um, benefits to the design process. Um, so I've just said design of working together is called collaboration. There are many benefits to the design process. So that's kind of my um, opening statements. Now what I need to do is give an example. So if we say designers, um, what could we say, from different fields can um, share expertise. So I've kind of given an example there. Um, I now can give an example. Um, an example um, of this would be, um, what could we say, the design of med medical equipment, the design of medical equipment, um, which would need Um, a combination of um, medical and um, and new Off the edge of their manufacturing um, so the design of, uh, an example would be the design of medical equipment um, which would need a combination of medical knowledge and manufacturing knowledge so I've given an example um, and then I've added an, a specific example. I think I'll give a second specific example, so a uh, um, Paul um, would be the design of our phones um, in which uh, what would I say an example moment in which electronic engineers uh, 
and product designers would work together. So, so I've given a second example there, which would be the designer mobile phones in which electronic engineers and product designs, designers would work together. Um, I could say some some companies um, such as clothes retailers um, may use outside designer um, to work with their own brand. That should be there. Okay, so I'm getting into this now. Um, engineers and product designers. Uh, some companies, such as closed retailers, may use outside designers to work with their own brand. So that's giving like a different type of example, and that might be getting famous people to work with a closed brand or other famous designers. It might be sports people, someone like that. Okay, so there's another design, another um, example. We can finish off, I think, by saying groups of um, designers working together um, working to the can share in array inspiration and experience to create superior products okay there so quite a big chunk of writing there but we've given started off with a, a, a sort of overarching statement We've given an example of collaboration between two things there and two. They're quite similar, but we have given two different examples. Um, then we've said about the clothing industry, and then we've just said a general overall comment to finish up with how designers working together can create superior products. So there it is. There, I think that would get us our eight marks there. Um, so that's the design, the communication of ideas and design collaboration. Thank you for watching Mr. Ridley's Design and Technology.